Bum 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 bum. Tomatoes. Hello, welcome to the video for what is is packaged for distribution. We're going to go ahead and run through our example here, and it's not going to be too quick, but it's going to cover what we need. When I hit play and I hit execute, I get back false. Let's go ahead and look at our node, and the node's pretty simple. Is package for distribution will return true or false whether it's a build that is packaged for distribution. As this is a play and editor, it's not packaged, therefore I get a false. It also applies to things like the standalone game. Even though it makes a standalone version for playing, it's still in the editor. And it's going to return back false as well. Now by a package build, let me shoot this back. It means something like file, package project, windows, and then your version. So I'm going to package this for Windows 64 and put it in my test build folder. Now, this will not work. This is still going to give me back a false, but I want to run it and show you and then explain why. Just because we're packaging it out doesn't mean it's the proper package version for shipping. There are actually two different versions. There's both the development version and the production version. Right now, by default, when you package, you get the development version. So let's open up this file. We'll run this package version. And when I hit execute, we get false, which is what we expected. Now, let me delete this. So we can show that it's a completely new build. Under file package project, under build configuration, it defaults to development. This is your testing version for de development or debugging purposes. The shipping version strips out a lot of unnecessary things. So now that we've set it to build to shipping, I'll package this for Windows and we'll let it rebuild. It'll take a short amount of time. Once it's done and we run it, we're actually going to be running the shipping package version and since our node is packaged for distribution it's not packaged for development or testing this will return back our true value so this is finishing up it's almost done let's go back to our folder here it package is complete we'll run this this time when we hit execute we get back true so that's something to keep in mind even though it's packaged and it's ready for distribution it has to be a production version which is under our build configuration, the shipping version, in order for it to be proper for this node. Now in terms of uses for this node, if you're sending out different versions, testing versions, testing production versions, testing shipping versions, this is useful for writing out for your debug logs and your tests. It'll let you know exactly which version was used, and you could also use it in conjunction with some other nodes, such as the engine version or your build version, to know exactly what the tester, if they're filing a bug report, is using. So that's it. That's our is packaged for distribution node. Gives you back true or false. And it's really only going to be true if you've packaged for your version in the shipping version.